the students of the 5th and 8th grades of Baku Oxford School in Shemkir express their gratitude to the teachers who are like a lamp of knowledge illuminating their lives through the dark paths of reality of those days. The students of Boston Shemkir express sincere appreciation to Mrs. Mehriban, the president of Baku Oxford School, for setting high expectations for the students of Boston Shemkir at this difficult time. You have shaped the conditions for our teachers and students to learn and succeed by having online classes. We are grateful for your impact on that school. Today I have an opportunity to express my gratitude to the teacher of our school. And of course, first of all, I express special thanks to Mrs. Chultachin Razayeva, our principal who is always our guide and shows us the right direction and path to walk. They say, if your action inspires others to learn more, do more and become more, you are a leader. Thank you Mrs. Chultachin for being our leader. I am grateful to our homeroom teacher Mr. Lichin Suleymanov. I know we haven't always made things easy for you. Not all of us were as consistent as others in studies. Yet, you treated us like a friend, giving advice and like a parent, being strict but respectful. The teacher who takes special place in my heart is our world history teacher, Mrs. Sabina. By following the past shown her lessons, we were able not only to travel through the epoch of history, but also be able to build a strong society. Also, I want to thank our teacher from history department, Mr. Bakhtiar. Due to his lessons, we learned a lot about Azeri history, and now we can share the information about our national heroes with people in other countries. It's very important to have a teacher to move ahead in life and solve difficulties that come, so that we can learn from her. With our teacher of English literature, Mrs. Kulara, we were able to meet with world-famous classics who lived and created their wonderful books in Victorian Apple and we could learn virtues through their heroes. Thank you, Ms. Kalara, for making it possible. Mrs. Helen and Mrs. Ba are science teachers. I would like to thank you for the valuable contribution you've made into our knowledge this year. Just as a craftsman makes useless stones with devotion and patience to create something beautiful, you encouraged us to become curious people by presenting important issues. Special thanks to our math teachers, Mr. Masim and Mr. Niazi. Your endless positivity made it a joy to come to class and learn a very serious subject, math. Because of you, we can conquer any difficulty that comes our way by learning math. You helped us push through those complex math problems. I would like to express my gratitude to Mr. Nick, one of the members of English department. Thank you, Mr. Nick, for teaching us a real English accent ABT for, for your amazing lessons. I really enjoy the creativity and unordinary methods of presenting the lessons. Thank you very much. Thank you, Ms. Solmaz and Ms. Mehbara for being our English teacher. The best teacher is the one who inspires her students to ask the question, which she finds it difficult to answer. During your lessons, you have made us think about difficult questions to ask you, and you have always found the answers. I appreciate lessons to the Russian teachers Mrs. Sibyl, Mrs. Kiltakin, and Mrs. Naila were having with us. As a great Russian writer, Anton Chekhov said in his beautiful play, Chaika, Life should be depicted not as it is and not as it must be, but in the way you dream about it. With your guidance while reading amazing pieces of Russian literature, we saw the world of our dreams. Thank you very much. I also want to speak about a person who is a member of Russian department, Mrs. Sivinch, who gave her parental care to some of her students staying on camps. With her help and amiable attitude, we don't feel homesick. 
Thank you, Mrs. Savage, for your friendly and cordial approach. Our language teachers, Mrs. Ednara and Mrs. Safa, could make a special aura in their French and German classes. Thank you very much for having such an amazing atmosphere in your class, where you have learned not only languages, but also were able to get acquainted with their country's cultures and lifestyles. My father always used to say to me that school period is a golden period in a person's life. Now I start to realize it as it's not only learning, writing and having tests. It's something that you enjoy doing like music and dance classes. We are a wonderful teacher in our school, Mrs. Ada, our music teacher, and Mr. Sanan, dance teacher. Thank you very much for teaching us local as well as foreign songs and dances. Mr. Rao, thank you for making our world brighter on those dull days. This year was not easy for all of us, your students and our teachers. Nevertheless, with your talent as a teacher of art, we enjoyed joining your art classes, where you acknowledged us with wonderful artists and their works by providing us with material resources and useful information. I would like to thank our principal and all our teachers on behalf of my students. Thank you for supporting them and increasing their confidence in their knowledge. <laughs>